Hi everyone, Annie from Interact here. Hope you're all having an amazing day. Today, um, just like every other day, I go check out our customer quizzes, curious to see how they're applying our quiz software to their businesses. And um, I love the um, company that I found this morning because they do, um, they use their quiz not on their main site, but they used it in the body content of their um, resources section. So on their blog um, and uh, they used it for education. So let's go ahead and take a look. This is Consider the Wildflowers and they are a jewelry website. Um, I haven't done too much um, shopping on their website, but let's take a look. I love sort of these heirloom pieces that they have. Um, they do custom work. They've got everyday jewelry. I'm definitely going to check out that everyday jewelry because you can never have too much beautiful, simplistic jewelry. Look at that birthstone necklace is gorgeous. Oh, definitely going to be checking some of these out. So there website is beautiful and simple and I can see uh you know what they're really going for here is really having that elegant clean feel and design the journal is where we are gonna go and this is their content section their blog section so they've got four categories leisure and lifestyle styling and merchandising interviews and features and education and learning and ours uh, where we're looking is under education and learning. I actually already pulled up this blog post and it's called Interactive Engagement Ring Quiz, the four structure styles of engagement ring settings. And so the company, Consider the Wildflowers, did a great job in taking all of the research and institutional knowledge they had about making a beautiful um, and lasting engagement ring. And then they put it into a quiz. And so not only do they have the quiz, this little link right here goes out to the quiz, but then they have sort of some content below that talks a little bit more about what the quiz is going to have in it. So let's take a look. Which engagement ring style is best for you? Which word on this page really resonates? Ooh, okay. I'm going to go with elegant. Your morning routine includes drinking coffee or reading, spending time. Hmm. Well, we don't wake up at the last possible minute, but it is pretty frenzied because we have kids. So I'm going to put it out there because I think that really captures the frenziness. And just for um, some quiz strategy, you want to, the uh, person taking the quiz to be able to very quickly say, that's the one. That's the answer. And so keep it simple. Don't use too many words. Make it easily readable. Um, here's a great example of that. Your Pinterest board is filled with travel and adventure, vintage furniture, easy weeknight recipes, street style and fashion. Hmm. I'm going to say travel and adventure. I'd rather be overdressed than underdressed. Ooh, I guess so. How would you rather just describe your style? Feminine and full of details, minimal, bold, or statement making effortlessly classic? Well, I'm going to try and hope I think a lot of people try to be effortlessly classic, but we, who knows? <laughs> it's probably just simple. Your list of favorite jewelry pieces is not complete without an antique family heirloom, a bold metal ring, mixed metals, dainty necklace. I've got the dainty necklace. Um, my daughter and son, when he was um, her age too, um, she whenever I'm holding her, she just kind of holds the, holds the bean. This is the Elsa Peretti bean and she just holds it like that. It's a very simple everyday necklace. Your go-to evening wear, leather, neutral, jeans and tennis shoes, dress and heels, probably dress and heels. What are you uh, up to most Saturdays? Being a parent. See, there it is, being a parent. So like, generally encapsulated because on a Saturday morning, it's get food in them, rush to your activities. You know, there's ballet and there's archery and whatever else the kids are doing. Then maybe there's a play date. There's no yoga or rest or anything like that. And so I think that, um, you know, this company, I uh, consider the wildflowers really understands that the things that you put on your body, like for jewelry or clothing, need to 
be comfortable and embody that lifestyle because if they don't, then you're not going to wear it. You just started looking at rings. So far, the diamonds you like are do, 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 rose cut, unique alternatives, antique cuts, fancy shapes, round brilliant. So um, I personally love the Asher cut, which I consider an antique cut, but um, it's really a square emerald. So I'm going to put antique cuts. All right. Here we go. Let's see our results. Ah, the cathedral is a characterized by additional supports that uh, elevate the diamond above the band. Uh, additional supports can be seen from any angle. It's stylistic. There's extra protection, extra protection because you don't want to snag your ring. I actually have a cathedral style ring, so that's really great. And then there's a call to action and clicks right through to the category of cathedral style rings. Oh my goodness, look at this one. Wowie, wow, wow, beautiful. Actually, I have um, a ring in this exact style. And so the quiz just really is intended to understand how you live because the jewelry that you put on your body needs to um, blend into your life. You um, shouldn't be, you know, wearing jewelry that you need to work around. If you're doing dishes all the time, or if you're working on people's hands or you're working on cars or, you know, if you're painting like I am often, um, you know, your jewelry needs to be able to flow with your lifestyle. And um, I love that Consider the Wildflowers created a quiz to help people really kind of understand their lifestyle a little bit and to be able to talk about it a little bit um, in a categorical way um, so they could effectively uh, do a product recommendation for the category of type of ring setting because you know when you're getting married a lot of times this this engagement ring is one of the largest expenditures that you're going to be putting forth um and so um and it's also often an heirloom piece that gets passed down generation to generation so you know you want to make sure that it's not going to fall out it's going to be safe given all of the activities and given your lifestyle all right, so consider the wildflowers. It's WLDFLWERS.com is the website to check out if you want to take that quiz also and learn a little bit about your style. You can also make a quiz for free at AI.TryInteract.com and check out our new assisted AI builder. It's uh, super easy. You just enter a website, enter a couple of descriptors and, and where you want it to go, and then boom, um, you know, we get we get a quiz turned around for you really quickly. So I had a really great time going through this quiz with you. Thanks for spending time with me. Let me stop this share. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you tomorrow.